so this is probably the worst lighting you could have well not the worst it could be darker but if we can get anything better than this it's going to be great for you and your video or your stream or whatever it is so i'll turn on the elgato light and hey that's not too bad and then you know like, that's that's pretty good and you know like, how do those other youtubers do it and then you go ah oh, wow <laughs> wow and I'll turn this one off and just use one that's actually like a consumer, like something normally you'd go out and buy from like your, for us in Christchurch or in New Zealand, it's PB Tech um, or Computer Lounge. And if you guys are overseas, then it might be like Micro Center or something like this that you can go out and buy one of those Elgato panel lights. Now this is the Air, so this is the smaller square one. I know there's a the bigger one, which will probably give it way more light than this one here. But this is a good, I think, um, thing to look at when you're trying to figure out what you want to do with your lighting. Um, and you just don't want to use just normal ambient lighting in your room to see if it's actually a good light source. So at the moment, this thing here is pumped up to about 75%. I'll, I'll go 100%. That's 100%. Um, you can see me. I'm just wearing a hat because I've got like messy hair. So it's, it's not the best best way to do it. And now I'm just going to change some of the, so I guess that you could say the yellowness of it, but you're just changing the Kelvins from 5600, now it's at 3700. And I'm just using the app um, on my phone. Don't look at my face, look at the phone. Oh, there you go. Um, I'll turn that off. Back to bad lighting. Now let's turn on this big aperture light. And it's a totally different experience, right? The things that I figured out so far is that more light is better because you can always change the camera settings to make it darker like you can change the exposure settings but less light sometimes makes it quite hard for you to be i guess easily exposed or well exposed so at the moment i've set this to expose me at about 75 percent exposure and then there'll be some white stuff back here that's fully like blown out which i don't really care about and then these panels here uh, i think around about that 70 80 as well or maybe a little bit higher actually um so i should look pretty good now these big lantern panels that i've got going on which is using a, a 300d from aperture and then the lantern on top of that so you get quite a lot of money and i think a lot of the youtubers um that i sort of watched and researched and looked at were using like the 120s or there's a new amran 100 um, and 200x and those lights they'll be amazing um but they cost money and that's the thing that like this setup at the moment the lantern in New Zealand dollars is I think uh, $200 and then the actual lights about 1800 to 2000 um, so that's quite an expensive setup plus the stand and everything else now the the light from um, Elgato I'll turn this off unlock my phone this light here I think was I think for me a 229 299 which isn't I, I thought not too bad like it's a great light I mean obviously it's not nearly as bright and it sort of ruins the whole experience but if you're say streaming and you're, you're doing this you just need to be seen so I feel like it's not that important to have that massive blowout where you're perfectly lit now if you're trying to do video content then something bigger might be a better option but then you just got to weigh up the, the cost because maybe you need to buy like a mic and then maybe you need to buy an editing computer and then you need to buy the camera and the lens and it just becomes this like horrible long list of expenses and luckily I mean I love this stuff so I guess I just spend my money on that and don't go out drinking and stuff like that that often but if you've got dependents and you've got other things to pay for then you probably can't afford to spend all that money on everything and think oh perfect setup especially if you've got like in my case like two viewers so then there's like no one watching it anyway so you're like whoa I just spent my life savings on this and I should have put it in GameStop and I would have been a millionaire anyway the the light panel is really good i'll do some b-roll you can see the controls and everything are amazing um, you can use the app on your phone or the app on your computer uh, you can control it wirelessly from around the house where you're on the wi-fi connection um, which makes it quite good and you can also just tweak and change anything and if you've got any other elgato sort of things that are set up as well like multiples you can control them all together like my nano leaf here is awesome i can control it and i can set up like little routines on it the only thing that this doesn't really connect to the home app on your home um, system on your Apple, so you can't really just turn it off at a single button, but there's an app for it. That's pretty much all I wanted to go through, just to show you the comparisons, because I never had someone really give me the, what, I didn't get to find a video anyway, of someone showing the two different options, but showing it in a streaming setup, because I'm videoing this through um, OBS, not through my camera. So it's not gonna be crazy color grades. This is just run at 1080p with 50 frames a second, and. The mic's coming through here as well so hopefully you can get a bit of an idea what it's like 
compared to say someone going full production off their camera 4k down resin it to 1080p and then making it look all shiny with some crazy as color grade this is just really out of the box oh there is one thing this is on uh, cine 2 if you're wanted to know that and then I'll be using like a Leeming light which is this guy called Paul Leeming which is really good um, but you don't really need to know that stuff if you're streaming you just need to know that your camera can connect you've got enough light it's fine right like you can still see me it could be brighter um, obviously that's brighter but that's also 10 times the price and you need to be able to hear and you've got good quality content and you can make a make a joke or two I hope that helped any questions please ask otherwise um, have a good day Namaste. I can't do peace. Everyone does peace. Namaste.